scapegoats bagging along dark. <laughs> We're trying to get a fire started. I've tried four times now. It hasn't worked. Our bushcraft is not great. I understand maybe out in the wind, but it's a fireplace for the love of all that is holy. Okay. I need you. There we go. Okay. It's only going to last. We're going to add fuel. What do we got for fuel? We got, we got a bunch of sticks. Let's put all those sticks in there. Um, I'm going to probably break down a chair. Hopefully my fire doesn't die out in the process. There we go. How much time is left? 33 minutes. Nice. Add fuel. All right. So we're going to put this, uh, reclaimed wood in there. Now we're going to try to cook because I put some, I think I put meat. Is it still here? Is it gone bad? Gamey, 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 gamey. Okay. So not bad. Someone told me I could put it outside. So I should probably put it outside. But now that we know that, let's cook. Okay, um, gamey venison. Let's cook that. And then, uh, cook more gamey venison. <laughs> 57 minutes until ready. Four more. Oh! This is because it has a cooking pot, I guess. All right, well, that makes sense, I, I guess. I don't know. Now, I could... Try to rescue all this meat, but it's not really going to be worth it. I just need to eat, find more canned food and stuff because how long is this? 16 minutes. Come on, three minutes. Let's go. Empty, empty. I think, I think we've managed to search everything. Maybe. I guess we'll find out. I'm going to eat this. There we go. Eat it. There we go. Fresh venison. Nice. That didn't really fill me up as much as I thought it would. To be honest, it's only five minutes. All right, excellent. How much longer is left on this? An hour. See, we got enough to cook everything. All right, here we go. It's nice to have this little fire here. Come on, bud. Don't go bad at me now. But there's no point in carrying all this because it's raw and it's just going to get us attacked by wolves. And that is not what we need right now. We'll eat that up. That'll give us quite a bit there. Now, can we... um? Oh, we got a can. Nice. All right, let's put a can on there and make herbal tea in 13 minutes. This is just about ready. Going to take this. Going to eat it. All right, there we go. That fills us right up. And this is six minutes until melted. I'm not sure how long it's going to be until it's boiled, but until then, I'm going to break down a few crates just for extra wood. So if I need to build a fire, I can, and we're good to rock and roll. All right. Oh my god, I'm gonna take this cooking pot too. Take this. Oh my god, you're gonna be 15 minutes? What else can I break down while I'm waiting? How long is this gonna take? 30 minutes? Anything small I can break down? An hour and a half? What about you? 15 minutes, break it down. <laughs> Perfect, okay. Is this boiled now? Okay, let's, uh, let's drink it. That should warm us up a little bit, I think. All right, so we've already spent longer here than I wanted to, so let's, uh, the fire's just about out. Thank you. All right. Let's, uh, see if we can move on. Ammunition is scarce. It says that right in the, oh, geez, yeah. Oh, yeah, you can't go down that way. You gotta go around or you'll end up dead. Speaking of which, where's my gun? Nope, that's not my gun. Is this my gun? Yeah, okay. Okay, so we're good there. But next time I know to leave my uh, deer outside, or any meat I shoot for that matter. No, I came from over there, I think. I don't remember. All right, let me see. What do we got in here? What's this? I'll take that. You could probably shelter from the cold out here, but with the cabin nearby. Now, where did I come out of? It's been a while since I played, so I don't know... There's a dead deer over there. We're getting colder, but we're not getting cold too fast. So we do need a little better clothing in a sense, but nothing drastic. My goal today is to find out where I am and how to get out of here. So let's go up this snow if we can even get out. We seem to be trapped in a bit of a valley. Maybe we can see something from up here. Oh, is that a... Looks like a ranger tower on top of there.
But I don't foresee us getting down this hill without hurting ourselves anytime soon. Ooh. Well, maybe. Let's get over here a little bit. I wouldn't even know how to scale that mountain. It's very steep. It's very steep. We got a steep hill warning. There we go. Let's try this. It's nice to know there's warnings out there for steepness. That's... That's handy. Now, we're not going to approach this thing from this way. I can tell you that already. Um, but we're going to go up that way and see if we can't see it a little better. We may need to stop and build a fire for warmth, but currently everything else is doing pretty good. We are a bit overweighted, I think. No, actually, we're not too bad. We're actually... Wait a minute. Is that on my person? Oh, it's cooked, too. Nice. All right. We'll eat that in a little bit. But that does give us a way to wolves. Wolves and large predators will track the scent of meat. More so, I think, if it's raw, but I don't know entirely. I just know there used to be a warning in the game that you'll be tracked by the meats you carry. What's down here? Is that a hunting-like thing? What do they call it? Is it blind? No. Is it blind? It might be a blind. Unnamed pond. Okay. A survival bow, practical gunsmithing, pinnacle peaches, a whetstone, of all the things I could have. Uh, is that, oh my goodness, painkillers, what was going on we over here? use this. Yeah, you could, take it. Next time we find a place to rest, we're reading that practical gunsmithing. All right. Yep, we're definitely freezing to death. All right, let's, uh... There's a, yeah, there's a dead deer right there. Which I could take, ugh, if it wasn't too gamey or rotten, I could probably take it for food. But I don't, it means something's killed it, and that's the last thing I need. Now, we are starting to get a bit cold. And I'll give you a bit of a, a tip that I've learned with this game over the years, is that if you get to 50% cold, start thinking about your next move for shelter. Because death is not too far away. <laughs> We're at about 50% of our, our cold temperature, so we're going to keep... Keep an eye out for that type of stuff. Also, too, if you're looking for shelter, hugging the, the rock face can be quite helpful in that situation. Because a lot of times there'll be caves or things like that that you can get into and, and warm up. I'm walking to conserve some energy, but it's not conserving a ton. I'm not sure we can make it up this hill. This may be too steep for us. Oh, no, we're making it. We're doing all right. It's just taking a lot of energy, I'm sure. This may be a bit harder. Okay, don't slip, brother. And it's the last thing I need right now in the middle of the whatever this place is. The cold. When is it summer? So far, we have a gun if we get attacked by a wolf or a bear. The bear attacks are the worst because you, you wake up. Oh, what do we got here? Wait a minute. I circled around. That's what I did. I totally circled around. How is that even possible? Because I went out that way and I somehow managed to circle all the way around. Well, this is great. We're going to go along this ridge line and see what's up. Well, this has been a lovely adventure. Going around in circles. Appreciate it, game. Yeah, now you're getting tired. Where am I going to sleep, bud? Well, you know what's not good? Mystery Lake. It sucks. Oh, well, you know what? Sometimes these things happen. I don't think I've ever done that before. I don't think I've ever circled around by accident. Deadfall area. Like tree deadfalls? What do you got for me, boys? There's a little stove here. Well, well. How now, brown cow? What time of day is it? Oh, it's, half, it's midday. Let's start a fire. Also, we'll take a charcoal. Let's start a fire with that stuff. And then we'll map it out and all that. We'll throw, we got some fir wood we can throw in there just for a little bit of warmth. It might help to cook up some water, boiling it, and drink it hot. Bam. All right, here we go. Add fuel. All right. What do you got? Fir wood. Add fuel. There we go. The 
stuff will come in handy. Take this, and we're going to put this in here as well. All right, here we go. Fir wood. Or cedar. This is cedar. Add fuel. No, we're going to we're gonna hang on to that. All right. Oh, let's just, uh, let's cook. Oh, we know we'll cook some peaches, because, like, why not? That'll warm us up. All right, how long do these cook? What, 15 minutes? Yes. All right, excellent. How much time do we have? Two hours and 30 minutes. Ah, uh, we can wait here. Get warmed up. Get our old peaches in us. That's getting closer, and I don't like it. The wolves is coming. Let me get my peaches warmed up, and then we can get out of here. One minute. Come on, peaches. Yes, eat this. Oh, that is so much better. Okay. Now, we do need to uh, wake up. Can we um, cook up some herbal tea? I should have done it both at the same time, but I wasn't thinking. Because I think that gives me a little bit of energy back. I think it's because of the caffeine in it, maybe. Currently, I'm more concerned about how much how much is left in this 2 minutes and 20 seconds. I'm going to drink this tea. Then I might lay out the bedroll for two hours, try to get a little bit of sleep in. Because currently, uh, we kind of need to. Is it a tool? What is it under? Bedroll. Here it is. We'll sleep right near the fire. Hopefully not get eaten by a bear or anything. Get maybe two hours sleep until this is just about worn out. Okay, come on, baby. Just give me, give me, give me that three, three minutes of tea. And that shouldn't take all the time away from the day, but it's going to start getting dark soon. So we're going to have to find a real place to shelter down. Oh, come on, herbal tea. Give me what, show me what you've got. Drink that. All right, nice. Okay, cup of herbs. Mmm, good little herbs in me there. Take this can back. Okay, so we're going to, we're going to sleep for two hours. Now, that's not going to give us a lot of energy back, but it's going to give us a little bit of energy back. <sighs> See, we got about half our energy now. So, two hour sleeping stints is great. Thank you, Fire. You did a ton. Warming up expired. Got it. Looks like we got a bit of a wind kicking in here. So, what's a good sign is, is that people come out here. So, obviously, they exist out here. And that's exactly what we needed to find. I don't want to be out here at night, though, because it's going to get friggin' cold, you turds. Friggin' cold, you turds. Okay. Now, we don't need to be out in the cold. At least there's a lot of sticks around if we need to make a fire, I guess. But the wind is not going to allow for that. You know, someone asked me in the comments the other day. They said, oh, a road. <gasps> this is this is good. This is good. They asked me, am I ever going to play something with guns and things like that? And it's like, you know what? I don't, and I explained this thing was in a live stream, and I, I, I'll explain it as best I can, but guns are boring, and every game has them, and something about tackling the environment that's always trying to kill you as opposed to some monster or bad guys of some sort just seems, it seems better and more fun to go after uh, this kind of stuff instead. Because this is hell, like hell of a lot more difficult than say Battlefield or um, Seven Days to Die. If you jack up the skill level on this to hard and play it, it's much a much harder game. Well, we got a building right here. Oh my God, we may have found our new new home for temporariness. Oh God, it's cold out here. Yeah, our temperature's still good though. What is this place? This looks lovely. What what do we got going on here? A little Canadian flag flying? It's like a is this a mail place or something? Post office? It's right off the the line there. Well, look at this. Interesting. Oh, there's a sign. We'll read the sign when we get there. Sorry about all the walking, but it's the only way to survive this. Mystery Lake. Oh, that's it. What's this? I thought I just heard a bear. Looks like we might have a fishing hut out on the lake there, too. Couple of them. Is this the lake, then? Is this Mystery Lake itself? It's getting dark, though. We should probably... Whoa, look at that. That's cool. Look at that. Excellent. Okay. Let's open this up. I do wish we'd find more lantern fluid. I just... Oh, this isn't bad. 
This, this is a camp office. This is good. It's got a stove. It's got some paperwork. Oh my god, let's search this up. Let's see what's going on in here. What do you got for me, bud? Oh, nothing. Okay. Good place to bed down for the night. Ooh. Tomato we'll soup. Delete this. Ooh, you know, people said that stuff is. Oh my god, is that maple syrup? It friggin' is. Oh, bud. We already have one of those. But ours may be worse off than that one, so we will check that. But not right now. Right now we gotta... Can we take a piece of charcoal out of here? Is that possible? Take charcoal? Yeah, okay. Cannot map indoors. Great. So let me just head outside for a second. <laughs> We're gonna go map. Because it'll, it'll help us out later. If we ever come back through this area. And mapped. All right, excellent. Not a great mapping of the area, but we got an idea where we are now. All right, we're at a we're at a camp office, baby. All right, let's see. What else you got for me? What What do you got here? What's this? Oh, that's nothing. This is a crate. This is a chair. And we got antiseptic. Frontier shooting mean. guide. I should research some of this crap. There's two computers here. Pretty freaking fancy there. Uh... Oh my god, what's going on under here? Look at all these things. What is all this crap? It's got a... There's a lot of recycled cans around here. Oh my god, lantern fluid? Oh my god. I, fuel. I can use this. Yes, you can. Where's the... Where... Oop. Okay, where's the lantern? It's part of my equipment, right? Where is it? Where there you are, bud. Actions. Refuel. Oh my god, we got half of a tank of lantern fuel. Alright, back it up. Where is it, bud? Show me your lantern. Nope. There it is. Light it up. So we can see a little better. Thanks, boss. Oh yes. Yes. What is this? Oh my god, a storm lantern. What is that? A whetstone? <gasps> Fishing line. Give me that. What have we here? Um, I take this. Now, we should have two in our inventory now, right? Okay, wait a minute. This one's way worse shaped than this one. Okay. I'm going to turn this off for a second. Let me just see if I can harvest the fuel out of this. Well, I'm still going to harvest it because there's no point in having two and the other one is much better. What a waste of lantern fluid. I've driven doing all that complaining. Oh, no, we got fuel out of it. Nice. All right, so... That is a that is much better. That's what sixty percent here. No, I don't want that. Thank you. Turn this on, please. Turn this on, please. Perfect. Look at this. Oh, lanterns. Great. Good stuff. What do you got for me here? Antiseptic bandages. Mm. This is almost too good to be true. Looks like something happened in here. Search this drawer. Oh, beef jerks, man. Ooh, didn't realize that was outside. I thought it was like a tiny little office. No thanks. Go back inside. It is way too late at night to be wandering around, or getting on tonight, to be wandering around outside. All right, we could listen to the radio if we had power, but we do not. That is a huge thumbtack. All right. Where are we going here? Up the stairs, I guess. See what's going on up here. Hey, fish. Hmm. You, like you look like a salmon. All right. Got this cloth. We got these papers. Oh, no wonder. Hey, bud. You all right? No, you're dead. All right. Oh, Hopefully we got a needs this decent t-shirt, I guess. Now, we're definitely overweighted, but since we're in here, it's not a big deal. What's this book? Take this. Because we don't have to worry about getting injured or anything. Hmm, a decent wool shirt. Heavily insulated wool shirt, designed to keep you warm in the winter, retains good I'm warmth. I'm not sure I can carry much more. Yeah, we're not asking you to, bud. Just as much as we tell you to. Hmm, new combat pants. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. What do we got? Okay, let's check our... Our dude here? Okay, that's not right. Okay, this. What are you wearing? Decent work pants. Oh my god, this will bring it right up. Where are those? Why, why are we not wearing those now? Okay, that's a hoodie. Oh, this is a decent wool shirt. Let's wear this. And can we... We got that, we got that, we got that. Can we put the... Oh, let's wear this as well. That makes us a little bit warmer. What? What is this? Oh, it's our simple parkas. All right, no problem. 
Excellent. So they're not perfect, but they're better than they were. Was this more beef jerky? Nice. Okay. Ketchup chips. That'll come in handy. No, I don't need that. Don't need that. What is this? Firearm cleaning kit. Don't I have one of those? Or right, what's this? Don't want work boots. They're never very good. What's this? A note left behind. Beansy and I came up this way in the summer when we were knock-kneed goofy kids. What? Never heard that before. We fished and played with swords made out of sticks, wove leaky baskets from the reeds. You could row across the lake. Those little cabins on the far end were... The tourists came and fished and hunted and deer had their parties. We stood behind the counter and watched Dad welcome them, looked at the guest book and read the names. When the summer was nearing its end and the cattails turned to fluff, we blew our wishes to the sky, always to come back, always. Oh. Well, that's friggin', friggin' sad. On the plus side... There's a new bedroll here. Um, this looks good. Like this is this is the place. This is the place we need to stop and relax. We have multiple fireplaces. We have a dream catcher to protect us from all the evil nightmares. Um, we got a fish carpet, which really could you ask for more? Toyota. Okay, this port. No, there are some downsides, like a dead man. <laughs> not not exactly what I'm looking for in a place to stay. But on the plus side, like I said. It's getting on tonight. Is it getting dark in here? Let me see. Oh, yeah. It's getting real dark in here. Let's turn this back on for a sec. We're getting tired. We could use some water. Let's, um... There's a workbench here, which is absolutely phenomenal. Uh... That's empty. All right. So, what stove do we want to use? I think the one upstairs is a double stove, which I think... Oh, there's something under here. We totally missed it. Look. What is this? Is that dog food? Is it pork and beans, baby? I say, now this is just me, this is just me talking out my butt, but I'm saying we should, like, cook some stuff up and then maybe have a, cook up some water and maybe have a nap on the double stove up here. Okay, this is great. All right, so I'm going to take, I'm going to take this temporarily and that temporarily, and now we're going to go start a fire in here. Start a fire. I want to use my accelerant, but it seems like a bad idea. Because I'd rather fail a couple of times doing it this way than waste accelerant I may need on a windy, windswept day, you know? Come on. Come on. This is going very well, though. It could be much, much worse. You stupid oh, fire. Work. Start fire. Stop being a wuss. We also may need to hack up some furniture to get some... Uh, Oh my god, are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Start some fire already. It's paper and a book and matches. If you can't light fire on the inside with a book of paper, with paper, what do you do? We're not going to survive this at all. Come on, loser. Get your fire started. Loser. Add fuel. Let's see, what do we got here? Reclaimed wood. Put that in there. I'm going to keep these books because I can read those. How long does that give us? One hour and 42 minutes. Let's cook something. Um, cooking pot. Let's put the cooking pot down. Oh, we can put everything in there, I see. Mm, that's, what's our worst piece of food? Dusty tomato soup. Let's uh, cook that. There we go. And then we're going to cook... Cup of her. What? We just have this? Why do we just have this? But it's warming up. Ten minutes until the soup's ready? Four minutes until my tea's ready? This is going really well. Ah, oh, alright. Drink that down. Wait for five minutes for that to clear up. And then we can uh, sleep, I guess. What time is it? Oh, God, it's dark. Now, the first time I ever played the game, I spent a lot of time wasting lantern flu fluid <laughs> because I would forget to turn it off. So we're going to hopefully remember to turn it off this time. Is this soup ready? Mmm, tomato soup. Eat it. Perfect. All right. Now, we should probably get some water in us, but we're just going to pick this up because it's probably not going to be an issue. We've got an hour and 23 minutes left. Can we... 
you know what, actually? Put this on here. Cook down the water. It's going to take an hour for that to melt. And we'll do another two liters. Cook that down. There we go. So this is going to take about an hour. How much is this left here? An hour and 17 minutes. So I'm going to go break down a chair. So the fire doesn't run out. Sorry, guys. I don't mean to destroy your furniture and all that, but break this down. All right. So how long? How much longer? Oh, this, this lantern's running out. So 27 minutes and 25 minutes. This has got 43 minutes. But then it's got to boil heavy. once it comes out. So we're going to put it in for an hour and 42 minutes. We're going to shut this off. And that's going to make it real dark here. <laughs> so what other light sources do we have? Let me see. We got matches. Oh, wait, we could take a torch out of here, couldn't we? Not sure why I feel so tired. There we go. Okay, perfect. So that's all I got. Because you're, you're super tired, bud. Looks like they're set up for Christmas. Boy, this place is a lot more eerie with a torch than it is with a with a lantern. Let me tell you. Like, I feel like you'd be looking down, you're like this, like, what's going on? And people would come up to kill you, or a bear would be inside suddenly. Yeah. Thank God the bears don't break in in this game, as far as I know. Maybe they've changed that, but as far as I remember, the bears aren't breaking in. How long till it's boiled? One hour till boiled? Oh my God, this is, this is so bad. Why is this? You know, I'm going to add one more bit of fuel to this. Just so it doesn't run out. Okay, 58 minutes until boiled. An hour and 36 minutes. You know what we're going to do? We're going to do a little campcraft. We're going to wait for one hour. Perfect. Okay, so now 40. There we go. So we're going to uh, drink this. Probably don't need all of it. And then we're going to, to take that. All right, so now we're going to sleep. Let's sleep for eight hours. Okay, sleep. Ah, better. Okay, things aren't going horrendous right now. It could be worse. Okay, what? Okay, the sun's coming up, but we still can't see anything. So we need to get a lighter. What do we got here? What's this? Battery's dead. What do we got here? That's going out lantern. We have matches, right? Oh, my God. That's all we got is matches? Okay, well, you know what? Here we go. Light it. Okay, perfect. Now we can see again. So I'm going to take my cooking pot here, and I'm going to take this cooking pot there. Anyway, yes. So I'm going to leave this episode here, because this is the perfect place to end it off, because I just got sleep. Um, Yeah, so if you like this, please leave a comment. Maybe subscribe. Maybe tell your friends to subscribe. Maybe get your dog to subscribe. Maybe. Hold on a second. Maybe get your mom to subscribe. And if you didn't like this, well... You should probably find yourself a real YouTuber, because I'm not much of one. Thank you again so much for watching. Love every view I get. Scapegoat! I'm going to burn my fingers. Any second now. Out.